Hey guys, a small tip to easily select the length of the anterior denture teeth by using a stable anatomical landmark, the papillae incisiva. This is your prosthodontist, Dr. Amit Sadwani from Mumbai, India. Let's look at the papilla meter. Some companies have different names to it, essentially serving the same purpose. So what exactly is it? Well, the lip line is one of the most important parameters, especially when determining the length of anteriors. This device is an ideal instrument for measuring the length of the upper lip at rest and when smiling in action. With the information obtained, the length and position of the anterior teeth can be determined much more precisely, especially when you choose not to use a wax occlusal rim. Let's see a dentate patient. The incisive papilla sits directly behind the maxillary central incisors and its position is about 8 to 9 millimeters from the labial surface of the incisors. Here, the incisal edges of the centrals are directly behind the resting upper lip, but this changes in an edentulous individual, wherein the maxilla resorbs, but fortunately the position of the papilla doesn't change much in the posterior direction. Whatever is the change in vertical direction can be then measured by the papilla meter. To obtain an exact possible measurement, the patient should sit in an upright position. Then the papilla meter is carefully inserted vertically under the relaxed upper lip until it rests on the support at the papilla incisiva. There is an inherent correction in the device to compensate for the resorption of the ridge. Look how the notch seats directly onto the incisive papilla. For a better approximation, this procedure should be repeated one to two times to achieve the best possible result of the measurement. I would advise testing through multiple operators at the same time. Here are the two representative images, one at a position where lips are slightly apart and one when the patient displays a high smile line. Look how the size of the centrals and in turn the upper anteriors as a group look as natural as it could. To summarize the advantages, it precisely determines the length of the upper lip using a reliable indicator. The length of the anteriors, especially the dominant central incisors, can be measured more accurately. Well, that's it for now. Hope I have been successful in adding another instrument to your removable dentures kit. I will be conducting a masterclass in complete dentures next month in my hometown Thane. Feel free to connect with me or Dr. Mahi Sadwani for more details on the course content, hours of education, fees, etc. I would be happy to host you. See you there. Bye now.